Hello everyone and welcome to this video on why you should use the console. When we talk about the console, we usually talk about something called bash. Bash or shell um, stands for born again shell, B-A-S-H, and is essentially any Linux terminal. Most Linux or, or, or Unix type operating system like Mac use bash or similar uh, consoles um, and in this series of videos we're going to be focusing on using bash um, in, in the shell so in the console rather so why would you use the console that's the question here well there is two main parts of using the console the first one is that there are many programs that are available for your console or bash um, that are not available or at least not freely in in the graphical view of the operating system um, for example I'm sure there's some sort of easy way to do a ping um, but here on the console you can ping and this tells you some information such as well first of all it tells you that your internet connection is working because you're asking google.com to send you something back and whenever you receive that something um, it tells you how long it took you to receive it. For example, so it tests your speed to google.com, tests the status of your internet connection, um, and it, for now I haven't lost any packets, it tells you the stability of your internet connection with 0.0% packet loss, for example, and this is all writing two words in the console. And I'm sure uh, there's a way to do it in the graphical way, I've never had to do that. Uh, but I'm sure it would take a bit longer than the other console. And there are many more commands that you can also do. The second way is that actually navigating with the console is potentially faster than with the graphical way. So if I want to go to my documents, I have to go to my Finda, which you can see here. I have to go to, in this case, my documents and any other place like Anki and user1. Here I can just do cd change directory documents and key user one and i'm here documents and key user one oh don't know what that was backups collection two collection dot media collection media db delete dot txt Backups, collection dot anki two collection dot media collection dot media db delete dot txt so as we can see the console shows me the same thing, but it, I dare say it was much faster. So that is why it's quite brilliant to use the console sometimes, because it's faster. And this is essentially why you can use the console for some tasks. I'm not saying you should use the console for every task, but some tasks it's just easier when you're using the console than the graphical uh, view of the system, because A, it's faster, or B, it has some programs and some utilities and tools that are not present in your graphical view or are more difficult to find. So if you're interested in the console and how to use it, you may watch the next video in the series and we'll start going over how to use it.